everyone and welcome to a special smash look at Nimbitus, the Space Drone Constructor. Franz here as always and I've been granted a little bit of special access to this game from Straw Phone Studios. As you can see it's currently just going to be launching on Kickstarter, it will be live by the time you see this video so make sure you're heading over there if this is something you're interested in. It's basically a spacey like title and I've had my eye on this game for a very very long time and the de developers very kindly sent me along a key for it to have a look at it as you can see it's version 0.2.0 pre-alpha so anything you can and will see here may or may not change and there might be bugs but in the options menu you've got a lovely little bit here i love when developers split this part very very happy with that loving the music in the background and also give feedback if you want to so let's dive in so we can see what the game is just like so of course we're going to start up a brand new game so you guys can see right from the get-go what you're getting from Nimbitus. Now it's, you probably know this, this looks like very FTL, well it's quite different from that. Basically you're kind of like mining away but you have to find out ways, like there's been sort of early previews in that done on like little gifts and everything on Twitter and, and basically you can use lasers as almost like propelling your ship to cut through things as actual defensives and so on and so forth so everything has its own thing. Let's visit. A visit I wish to visit. Description. So, plant diameter, resource amount low, gravity normal, destroy transmitter, explore nearby locations, destroy highs, rare weapon. So, let's select our drone. So, let's create our little drone here. So, get tutorials. So, select a part from the list and add it by clicking the canvas. Parts must be placed inside the green circle. Parts up, up, or oh, oh, pick up parts by double clicking. You can move them, delete them, and move the canvas by dragging. And of course you've got here a slight part and use a mouse wheel to rotate it so you can actually rotate things and create kind of pretty cool pretty damn cool stuff and you can also test them i've eyes testing them because well i've had a few things that went crashy don't overlap parts uh, as this results into unstable physics reassign key to customize the behavior of the drone so you can actually assign keys to do particular things like if you want to turn on your thrusters turn them off turn on your gun so on and so forth combine sensor and logic parts to create automotive drones so basically you can create a drone that does its own thing make sure to add fuel tanks and batteries because well we don't want them just running out so that's a basic drone you got there you've got a winged one you got an automotive evading drone and you got a stabilized weight four way drone so Let's get into a little bit of building, shall we? This is our little drone brain. Uh, it's got a little HP and mass release. It's got a skill release drones and it's a 30 second cooldown. So we can come down here, you can see all the bits and bobs. So you've got jump thruster, thruster, and a small thruster. We've got the blocks to obviously build them up if we want to, and it kind of comes out here, or you can just put it to here, whatever you want. Right clicking takes that all the way. You've got your battery, so you've got your solar panel, you've got your large battery. And you've got your fuel tanks, you've got your little small energy shield, and you've got the motorized hinged, free hinge, and decoupler. You've also got a range of weapons, so we can have a blade if we want to. Can have, uh, there's lots of ra lasers and rockets, I almost said layer rockets or whatever. <laughs> you've got the sensors, so you can actually build up that way. And then you've got the gates, obviously. If gate activate this output key, if the input key is pressed, and we've got the impulse giver and so on and so forth. So let's get a little bit of the, I think we want to go with uh, something like this. Is there a mirroring? Is that a mirror? A recenter camera. It doesn't appear like there's a mirroring, but who knows? Yes, I do want that. Thank you. And then we'll just put a little bit on that side. And then we shall, what I'm going to do is build up here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that there. And then we're going to put that there. Okay. And then we're going to have a nice big... Can you put it actually on top of that? I know you can, but we can put our fuel here. And we can switch to this one and put our fuel here. And then we can have a lovely big battery, which we could actually put just out from there. Uh, well, they're not batteries. They're actually so... Oh, no, we didn't want that there. We did not want that there. We want it on this one. Yep. Then we're going to have our nice little battery. I think we'll tuck the battery in there, actually. Let's tuck the battery in there. There we go. Okie dokie. Now we can have some thrusters. Which, of course, we're going to go to the back one, though. And, no, we don't want to move you. We want to move you. 
So we're going to place that, and then we're going to turn it around. There we go. I'm going to get another one. I'm going to click on that. So you can see you can actually move that block all at once. But of course, we just want to place this down and place the next little thruster. Uh, I think that's there. It looks a little bit off-center, but I don't know if that's just me. So A to activate. Well, we can actually select these, and I'm going to press uh, S to activate. Let's make that S. And, no, wait. Let's make that W. W and W. There we go. So, needs fuel to work. Jump for needs... Oh, wait, I've just realized that's a jump thruster. Eh, you know what? I will change the button to maybe Q for these guys then. Because I do want to... There we go. And place that there. So, I'm going to make Q. And I'm going to make that Q. So, you get a lot of customization. But then we're going to just have our normal thrusters. Which I am going to connect still to here. Oh, I love how you can do that. That is actually pretty cool. And we're going to switch that to being this way. So I have our basic thrusters and we're going to have that W. And again, oh, no, here. I'm hoping they bring a mirror mode in, but then again, it might just not be there for me. So I have our basic thrusters there. There we go. Now, you're probably going to need a little bit of a small thruster on the sort of side bits, of course, as well. So we're going to actually put a little one there so it can make us go... That way. <laughs> Trying to work out in my head which way to go there. And then, oh, we don't want to move that. We want to move that little guy. Turn him around that way. And we'll make him go that way. Okay. I mean, you could test flight it. So, obviously... Look at this! Oh, look at this! Ah, what? No, don't shoot me! Q! Oh, wow. I'm like, uh, I'm getting beat up here. <laughs> I'm getting beat up here. Stop it. Stop it. Air resistance. What? <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. Gravity. How about we just take everything off? So that's air resistance, but if there's no air resistance, it just kind of floats away. What if we just kind of ram these guys? Hello. Right, so we got to go back to the editor, but there you go. That's your basic sort of, you know, it works. Um, it actually is pretty fast, but I noticed the fuel was actually getting drained pretty quickly. Which is something we probably need to watch out for. Anyway, I'm going to put an energy shield here. Uh, let's activate this by... via X. And then we'll put that there. And activate it by X. So a lot of this is going to be obviously building, testing, and then we can... Whoa! Protects from any projectiles and lasers, but it blew me up. I don't think it's meant to do that. <laughs> it actually blew me up. What if I put that out there then? Like, or if we put it out front, maybe? And do the same with you? That looks like a bug. I don't think that's meant to blow you up. I really don't think that's meant to blow you up. Let's get rid of that, and we can just delete that away. <laughs> um, we do think, I think we're going to need a little bit more fuel, but I'm not entirely sure yet. Uh, decoupler, let's see, what have we got here? Let's attach one of these. I want to see what this is like. Oh, come here, I have a present for you. No, nope, get, come here, come here, no, nope, come here, come here. No. <laughs> Oh, that's so good. That is pretty satisfying. That is pretty damn satisfying. Right, so activate the output key if the input key is not pressed. So this is that allows you to build up things so that you could use similar keys, but if you're not pressing like the decoupler or anything, then that's going to obviously do something different for you. If you say you had something like your thrusters attached to something, and then you could have these. Now, I do think we need a little bit more thrusters. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build up a little something here. I'm going to change that to go that way. Yes. And then we're going to attach a thruster to it. Nope. Nope. Don't do that. So we'll put that there and we'll attach a thruster there. I just love that the design work in this game is actual incredible. And I cannot wait to see this. And obviously, if you guys want to see more as well, please do let me know. And basically, if you're also 
wanting to make sure this happens, please do make sure you're checking out the Kickstarter. I always feel that's slightly off, but I don't know if it's just my eyes. Let's see, how does this go? Oh, well, we need to sign them. So let's put you W and put you W. There we go. Hey, there we go. Although I have noticed our fuel's coming down quite a lot, so we probably need to fix that. Let's see. I mean, our batteries, solar panel, energy capacity, these need fuel, and the lasers need batteries, I think. Yeah, it needs energy to work, needs energy, needs energy, needs energy. Spikes. Okay, so we're probably going to need to up our fuel capacity a little bit. And let's see if we could possibly, possibly take it like here. I want this one. No, I want this one. <laughs> and we could pop it in there. Is that going to be okay for physics wise? <laughs> or am I just breaking the game? Who knows? Let's find out. Does it all fit? Yes, it does. Whee! Right, we do need a little bit of a faster turning, so what I might do is put something out from there as well. Uh, let's pop you there. And then we'll grab you. Uh, nope, no, no, oh no. Let's turn that in, grab that, turn that out. Make it up a little bit. There we go. Now we're going to add some weapons. Because, well, we do know that it projects from energy... I mean, do you just put that in and then it just does its thing? No, it still blows me up. <laughs> Never mind, okay, we're just getting rid of that then. Alright, so let's see. Motorized hinge, free hinge, motorized hinge. Do you click on them? So rotate left. Oh, you could actually create a pretty cool craft from that. Bio bullet gun. Needs energy to work. Plasma short beam. Bio rocket tower. Bio rocket tower. Can you actually place them on that? Oh. So can you actually place them on top of that? No, it needs to. Ah. Well, that works. That works quite nicely, actually. Nope. That way. And uh, that way. Let's test out some weapons. Oh, my, 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 my. I am definitely chuffed with that. So that is obviously most, and you can actually choose it to biochemical or bullet. Oh, can actually... So we can actually choose that one. Let's see if that changes that. Ha. Huh. And we'll change... Also, homing rockets. Oh, that's... Wait, there are different towers? So get rid of you. And we can change you. They can have all three of them, though. Which I think. So we're going to bring you in. And change you to that way. Nope. Turn you around. I don't know, it does seem, yeah, it's slightly off, but I don't know if that's just because of the mouse there, but it will rotate anyway for you. So as you see here. Now we can have lots of rockets! Now we need lasers, of course, we need lasers to make sure we're getting this done. So, EMP rocket sniper, plasma sniper, plasma spark tower? What's this like? Let me see what that's like. Oh my! That is cool! I'm loving the visual representation in the game as well. I don't know if you can... Because can you change this to do different things? Is it possible to do that and then... Hmm. Let's do that. Unless you select this, click this. What's that one? Double particle gravity sparks. No? Hmm. Let's see. So obviously you can put your weapons into different things because you're probably going to be doing some other things. Although I've just realized I put that on Q, so we jumped ahead. 
Anyway, let's see where we got here. Directional sensor, speed sensor, directional sensor. Let's put that there. Now, let's not take that. Let's put a little bit of a sensor there. Terrain all. I'm wondering how this works then. Can you... Let's put that across to there. Put it like that. And also select it all. Don't think that's far enough over. No, it's not. Let's do that. Let's see what happens. So if I charge straight ahead... Oh, so it makes it kind of, like, come off of that. Ah, go away. I have missiles and I will kill you with these missiles. I'm going to just go with something without sensors, first of all, for you guys. So I'm just going to go with that. And then we're going to MP rocket, plasma bullet. Let's see what these guys look like. Let's have a wee test. A little bit slow firing, so we want to rid of that just now. Plasma Smart Tower Flames. EMP Flames. Are you kidding me? Give me that. Oh my. That is pretty cool. Flames. Uh, digging upgrade. Now, it doesn't seem to let me do that, but I'm going to have a wee look into that for you guys, and then I'll be back in a moment. Alright guys, I made a little bit of a, some adjustments here, so let's save and exit. So, yes, we want to use this little guy. Uh, we're going to name him, let's uh, call him, the Smash, Smash, Smash Drone 1. Because it'll probably change as we go along. Anyway, let's launch him and see what we get to do. So, yeah... It's going pretty damn fantastically, like what I'm actually seeing from Nimbata. So obviously I want to look off camera for a few minutes here while I test a few wee things. And it just seemed to be, everything seems to be working okay, but we won't know until we get in this. Alright. Uh, ow. <laughs> get out of here. Do you think there's enough drones here? Stuff? Right. Get lost. I am going, I am going droning. Go away. Oh god. Let's go. So you can see here that we're kind of drilling away. Which is quite nice. Although I think we've got ourselves stuck here. Let's go. Let's go. We don't have anything going up the way. At all. So we need lasers because our bullets aren't really cutting into this as quickly. So that's a lesson learned. Destroy had the destroyed one. Go away, you bunch of things. Okay. Now, I've just realized also I didn't put anything on to go backwards. And I didn't assign them, so that's one thing. So let's leave the planet. Uh, I need to select our drone. I need to edit it. No, I don't want to copy the drone. I need to edit the drone. So that's a few things, because uh, that was assigned and that wasn't. So... I uh, want to move to the right, so yep, and I want that to go, so I assigned those two, but I didn't assign them. <laughs> oh, wait, oh dear, oh dear, back there, what are you assigned to? You're assigned to that one, so let's put you in that one, and you're assigned, and you're assigned, okay, right, we have you on mouse, we have you on mouse, you... These guys are a mouse, but we need more of these. That was definitely a thing that I noticed there. MP rocket, flamethrower, plasma short beam. Alright, let's see. Where do we want to put you? We will probably want to put you there. Just turn you that way. So you can actually press control. And our control, like shift and control, and you can just then copy it right across. And Maybe put that there, actually, just back a little bit from the thruster. Might be a better idea. 
So that gives us that way, so that's going to give us an omnidirectional sort of thing. And then what we want to do is... Huh, can you connect? Oh. It's not, no, you could actually connect it directly to another weapon. That's cool. That's really cool. So then we could do that, and then we could hit Control c Control v just as if you're copying and pasting. And there we go. Right. We also need thrusters to the front, so we can actually move backwards. <laughs> um... I mean, in here is probably the best point. Yeah, we'll do that. Control c there we go. Bring it over. Put it there. Let's just test this. Uh, I need to actually assign them, though. So that's going to be S, and you're going to be S. Oh, man, look at that. That is cool. Right, okay, back to their saving exit. Let's launch that little guy. Right, so obviously you 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 can test flight them, but some of the things obviously I missed out there were you can't go backwards, you can't um, shoot to the side, you not big enough fire mounts. So, now we launch. Although I've just realized I probably built this the wrong way. <sighs> more the more! Ah. Get rid of the hive! Now we dig. Ah, okay, that's gonna be. We're out of power! Swing ourselves around that. Go with you! I need more power in this thing, it's too big. <laughs> oh man, this is so cruel. I've been looking forward to this for a long, long time. And of course you can create your own drone, like to just do its own thing as well, like an automated oh, wait. Okay, We need more power. I mean, those batteries are out there, but they do charge up, thankfully. Go away. I'm going to actually do something for you guys. I am going to leave this planet, I'm going to select a drone, I'm going to edit this, and I'm actually going to switch these, like, I'm going to get rid of that, and I'm going to get rid of that. And then I'm going to control C, control V, I'm going to do that. And that. There we go. That's gonna be cool. <laughs> And, well, we notice we need more power, so, how about, let's see, power, I mean, we need some batteries, so, let's pop that in there, and I don't think you can actually sign them on top of things, no, but we can, oh, nope, just put that there, and then we can attach that to there, and, nope, Attach that to there. Oh my. I'm super excited to take this out now. <laughs> but it does seem I've probably maybe d b built it the wrong way because, well, everything comes from below. And it would be nice to put it that way. But guys, I'm really hoping you're excited about this game because it's so cool. Alright, turn ourselves around. Don't you do that. I have some rockets that can kill you. Blame it all! Digging, going digging. Can I just shoot you with some rockets so you can leave me alone? There we go. Alrighty! <laughs> How cool is that? Right, we want to come back up a little bit. There we go, right. Okay. Turn ourselves that way. Oh god. Oh dear. Uh, even the camera changes around with you, which is cool. Those guys are cutting through that quite well. 
We do need a charge. I, I think we need more solar panels, though. Our fuel is kind of empty. I'm one for fuel cells, so we're gonna need to watch ourselves. Oh, hello, guys. How you doing? <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, I, I went the wrong way. Go that way. There is a gun over there. That is shooting me. Can I kill this now? Bye bye. Oh, vaporized them all. Hey. How about you don't do that? How about I come and bo boil you? Once I get around. I almost feel this is terror tech in space a little bit, but it's pretty cool. We want to turn ourselves that way. Hello, guys. I think you don't need that hive anymore. Oh, there's a transmitter. I think that's the transmitter. Let's just turn ourselves this way. Hello. <laughs> wow. Just vaporized them. That is pretty cool. Excellent. We destroyed the transmitter. It is completed. I think we need to add more fuel to this thing, but let's go. Let's have fun. If you're liking what you're seeing, like to see some more creations and everything, please do let me know because it is so cool. All right. Let's just turn ourselves around here. Need some better thrusters going on. It's going to vaporize you all. There we go. Another hive. I'm guessing it's going to be over that way somewhere. Hey, guys. How you doing? Coming to say hi? Ah. Oh. oh, God. Oh, dear. Our little backup thruster is not working as, as well as it hoped. So let's just go that way. We'll push up and out. Hey there. Ah, ow. Son of a... Ow. Okay. See ya. Don't want to be ya. Bye-bye. We're heading for that. Go for the... There we go. Right. There you go. You go to this plasma rocket gun tower. Of course, you get a little bit of there. And you can... You get a bunch of stuff, so that's it's some you get unlocks as you go along. So that is obviously the mission. And you can actually do different things with your drone as well. So we got there, you can actually jump in here, you can see plasma rocket tower. So we can actually have a wee test out of that quickly before we I mean it has a, a, a duration like it turned all the way around, which is cool. Anyway guys, this has been Nambatas. You can find the Kickstarter down below. Please do support the bit developers because I really, really enjoy this, and it's pretty damn awesome, and I think it has a lot of promise. I shall see you all next time. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's thick. That's cool. See you all next time. <laughs>